In today's video, I'm going to be swatching the new CND Shellac Collection Winter Holidays 2023. And the colors are Frostbite, It's Getting Golder, Midnight Flight, Poison Plum, Forever Green, and Scarlet Letter. This is not a new color. This was available in a CND Vinylux a while ago, I think. Okay, so I'm going to be swatching the colors on my nails. I already applied a coat of base coat. I cured it. And let's go. So I'm going to start with the with the worst color. <laughs> with the most difficult one. It's Poison Plum. I've used it to just put it on a swatch. And I have to say it's difficult to apply. I'm sure some people are going to love it. But it has a texture. that it's a little lumpy okay it's not easy to do your nails but at least you'll see how i do it and if you are attempting to do your nails maybe this will help you so i'm going to flash cure it because that sets the gel in place so it doesn't move anymore it doesn't cure it but it sets it in place. Okay, so let's do the green one next, which is Forever Green. I think this one has a very good formula. I have to say I'm absolutely in love with the brushes. So I try to stretch the colors as thin as I can. Midnight Flight. I've used this one. It's gorgeous. So the first coat is uh, um, not a true color. It's kind of sheer. The first coat. Scarlet letter. Okay, this is flawless, fantastic. Wow, beautiful. And frostbite. Please forgive me, my really awkward um, polishing techniques here for myself, but I'm not a professional swatcher. <laughs> I'm a professional nail technician, so I do other people's nails, not really my own. I usually wear clear, and I actually usually work on top of my lap, but to film, this, is, this setup is better. I'm going to fully cure. I'm really curious what you think about this color. Actually, the color is nice, just the formula. It probably needs like two layers of top coat. This would drive me crazy.
Wow. This one is so beautiful because it has that almost like a hidden shimmer, which looks like a glow. It's not too sparkly because some people don't like too much sparkle. This is, it's a winner. This is such a good color because it's kind of in between the bright red and the dark red. I know for sure I'm going to use this one a lot. With this one, you have to do like a full strokes because otherwise you're going to see the, the lines. Okay, very quickly, I'm going to put a top coat on off camera and the last color. Okay. Also, you have to make sure that you apply it with like even strokes from top to bottom. Otherwise, you're going to see the, the strokes. Okay. Okay, so they're ready. I have to say this one is a little lumpy bumpy. Not a huge fan. So I turned off the light to show you the, the true colors. This one looks a little bit lighter than I thought. It reminds me of uh, another color and I'm going to put it in the um, when I'm editing what color that reminds me of. There's another beautiful, beautiful color. But this is actually a very, very interesting color. I have to say, oh my God, this kind of looks like Black Pearl from Chanel, no? Kind of, like Black Pearl has more of a black underneath, but it has that green. Wow. Yeah, this is really good, actually. Okay, so I like it. <laughs> and I love the red one. I really, really do. And I love the blue one. These are actually good colors. The gold one, you have to be very careful how you get near the skin so it applies nice and thin it's a little difficult to do that with my left hand but overall please let me know which colors you like the most and which ones you're going to purchase thank you so much for watching guys bye